Quick question. Does anybody remember this? Restaurant thing. Oh no, it was fine. It was okay. fine. It worked out. Yeah. Thanks for having me. No, thanks for coming. All right, bye. Bye, yeah, I'll see you again soon. Sure, yeah. Okay, great. Bye. All right, bye. Oh Lord, this motherfucker doesn't know how to read people. Of course you remember that. But do you remember this? And then the moment I get off, you get your little courage back to make these basic bitch little digs, this little passive aggressive bullshit. Well, you guys know me. I don't deal in passive aggressiveness. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the shit she said and I'm gonna respond to some of it. Here we fucking go. You'll see who's really the fake person. Do you hate Joy? I don't like her, no. I tired of her talking about me and slandering me. Well, you're tired about me talking about you and slandering about you and I haven't talked about you in months. You don't want me to talk about you, yet you went on a live stream to defend your husband. We ended it peaceful. I thought everything was cool between us. Apparently, Joy watched a different live stream than I did because what I saw was this. Restaurant thing. Oh, no, it was fine. It was okay. fine. It worked out. Yeah. Thanks for having me. No, thanks for coming. All right, bye. Bye. Yeah, I'll see you again soon. Sure, yeah. Okay, great. Bye. All right, bye. But when I saw that, I saw Joy as the really happy one and like, you know, excited about the interaction. Whereas Lainey was more like the dude, but with the girl's attitude. Just kind of there and not really looking happy to be there and just kind of being like, yeah, sure, whatever. So, I don't know, maybe I'm biased. So I wanted to kind of just look through it, uh, make a couple of comments here and there, and see if maybe Joy wasn't right when she said, Oh Lord, this motherfucker doesn't know how to read people. Now this is gonna be just like the last five minutes or so of the debate, whatever. I'm not going through the whole fucking thing because <laughs> it's just, retarded but whatever so i'm gonna look at the last like five minutes or so and see if it really did end well <laughs> but what he's bring and i and i understand that that's a fair point but when he's bringing you into it and it has to do with abuse then if you, i'm just telling you what it looks like if you don't say something it looks like you support it and i'm just telling you what it looks like not what you when should I did do this thing, i said something to billy which is the person that was involved right but if you don't because your husband made it public if you don't address the public about it it looks like you support it i'm just telling you what it looks like i'm not saying what you should do what's right what's wrong but just what it looks like well he's he's the kind of person who likes to make things public and i'm not and so i guess therein lies the problem for you guys um because, like I said, we're different people. We disagree all the time. So, and right. if, I, if I have an issue with something he said or done, I tell him. But I don't need to tell him over Twitter. I don't need to tell him through my channel. I can tell him in person. And I do, often. He'll, he'll tell you that. Somebody, you know, I told you already. Sorry. I'm sure you noticed many things with which to address. First of all, She's playing with a fucking fidget spinner. Now that could be just like a, you know, a relaxing thing. I play with my lighter every once in a while, shit like that. But, you know, I, I don't know. Maybe it's a thing with kids these days. I haven't really a clue. But the whole fidget, if you're playing with a fidget spinner, like while you're talking to somebody, you're not really all that concerned. She doesn't really look engaged just by her body language. She doesn't really seem like, I mean, this is at the end of it. This was like a half an hour long. So she doesn't really seem like she's coming to any resolution. She's from the tone of the com, like from the tone of her comments, she seems like she's sticking to her guns. She hasn't been convinced of anything. So it, it doesn't really look like much has happened. You know, it's it's this this to me is kind of like jumping into a basketball game like halfway through the fourth quarter or something like that because score really doesn't matter up until that point anyways because if teams are good enough or uh, close enough to on par with each other the score is pretty fucking even going into the last half of the fourth quarter so uh, I'm kind of just 
saying suspend disbelief, I'm not going through the whole thing, but we're, we're seeing the tone of where it's wound up. The rest of it, as far as I'm concerned, doesn't matter because I'm not going over what they talk about. I can care less what they talk about. I'm just seeing if Joy is right or if she's crazy. <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> All right. I don't. I don't know if you have anything else you need me to clear up or whatever. No, I'm, I'm good unless there's anything you want to. Um, I'm just. It's nice to meet you. You are so sweet. It's really nice to meet you. Thanks. Will she happen? <laughs> sure. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so Lainey just did the, okay, I'm ready to leave now. And now Joy has started into a new conversation. And the conversation was, I'm going to compliment you one last time. And Lainey's like, uh, yeah, great. So, uh, I don't know. It looks to me like the, the, the brush off there. Uh, doesn't really seem like they're merrily chatting away with each other. I don't know. <laughs> to me, I can say that. I can sit here and say you've been really nice and respectful and, and really chill. And I enjoyed the conversation. I mean, she's like laughing at whoever, with whoever the fuck else is in the room. She's kind of gave them a look like, do you fucking believe this shit? I, I mean, I maybe I'm biased. Maybe I'm looking at it biased. I, again, don't really care. But, like, it's just that... That's what I'm reading off the situation. If you're reading something different, please let me know. Okay, I, yeah, I don't know if this really helped anything, but... <laughs> oh, sorry. I thought you were talking to me. No. Now that almost looked to me... Like, that was her looking at whoever the fuck else is in the room and going, you need me, right? You know what I mean? Like, it's like, oh, I think I hear my mom calling right before you get your ass beat. You know what I mean? It's, it's that kind of shit. It's, hey, like, tell me that you need me to get off this fucking thing so that I can leave. Because she's not letting me leave. You know what I mean? And it was after the first time she didn't let her leave that she's already looking for fucking help. So... I don't know. She she doesn't seem to be too into this. Yeah, I, I don't want to. Sorry, I gotta get going with the patrons. Okay. Yeah, we're all going now, so if you could say. <laughs> I do think that's kind of funny that he's like, he he still comes in to promote his Patreon. <laughs> uh... Okay. Awesome, that's what I was doing. I dropped something. Sorry. No, you're good. So, like, at this point, even Joy kind of seems like she's getting fucking tired of, you know, doing this shit. She's like, yeah, okay. Like, that was even kind of a brush off. So, what What in the fuck? They both don't seem to really care for each other at this point, so I... So, is that... Is, did he say he was leaving? Is that a... Is he not coming yeah, back? He, I guess he has, to, he has to live stream on Discord. Because they're oh, okay. at three. Get that plug in. It's a good woman right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. right on. Um, okay, well, if you, unless there's anything else to talk about, um, I guess I can I can get off here and uh, let you enjoy mm. your day. Okay. I, sure, yeah. I, yeah, I don't know if this really helped anything, but... Well, that's all right. Well, it's, <laughs> it's nice to meet you, and if, you know, you ever... Not that you're saying you have to, but if you ever feel the need to, to reach out and clarify something, not that you, not again, not that I, you owe me anything, but you know, I'm always, I'm, I'm here and I'm not like, I don't bite. I'm not a horrible person. Um, and neither are you, but, uh, you know, I'm, I'm happy to, if you ever need to talk I, about I, something. Honestly, I, it's just that I'm tired of all this shit. You know what I mean? Right. And it's because it's like not it, fair it, to it's you. It's nonstop about stuff that I feel is not even like. I don't know. It's, it's blown out of proportion. Sure. And it's like I said, yeah, I agree definitely. that it's not fair to you. <laughs> now, I'm not talking about what they said. Because, again. But it is kind of what they said. But it's not so much what they're saying here. As more what Lainey's not saying. But, to me, is heavily implying. Now, Joy says... If you ever need to reach out to me, go ahead and reach out to me. Lainey says, well, look, I just want for all this shit to stop. Right? Now, Lainey didn't say, 
I want for you to stop this shit. Which I think personally just, I mean, this is just my opinion. This is the way I'm reading the conversation as a third party that is whatever. It sounded to me like she was more saying, I want you to stop this shit as opposed to I just want all the shit to stop but even I want all the shit to stop well what does that mean she wants all this shit to stop she wants Greg to stop posting about it she wants Billy to stop talking about it she wants Joy to stop talking about it she wants everybody to fuck stop talking about it she wants all this shit to stop so Lainey's pretty much addressing everybody with this but she's talking to Joy and it's right after Joy says if you ever need me to help you, go ahead and reach out to me. And Lainey goes, I just want all this shit to stop. That's kind of like saying, you want to help me? Stop. But the funniest part about it is, she says all that and then goes into, you know, this is kind of bullshit. I don't want to be involved in all this. I want all this shit to stop. And Joey goes, yeah, yeah. And I can see how that would be totally unfair for you. <laughs> and like, Lainey's just like looking at her like, <laughs> I'm, I'm helping her pick out an outfit sorry no take your time oh lord this motherfucker doesn't know how to read people like seriously it wasn't that uncomfortable just that long dead air silence joy just like sitting there like and and laney's Doing other things, kind of like... It's that guest. That guest that nobody wants to have there. Oh, shit. Alright, I, I had to fix the battery. Battery died. I don't know why I need to tell you guys this kind of shit. I could just fucking roll on and edit it, but I don't know if it's like if, if it's further away or something like that, and then I'm going to get comments of people going, What the fuck happened? It was like you were there, and then it was there, and then it was there, and then it was there. I don't fucking deal with it. Anyways, so... She's like the house guest, the last the last person to leave the party. You know what I mean? When it's when it's three o'clock in the morning, and you're ready to go to bed, everybody else is gone except there's one dude that still is like we're still drinking, right? And you kind of look at him, and all of a sudden you're very concerned what time it is. Oh my god, whoo! It's late. You know what time it is? Man, look at the time. Yeah, it's that person. And, and they just sit there and go. Because they don't fucking get it. <laughs> I didn't know we were going to be talking. So it's not like we're saying I'm like being shady or something. But I'm just helping my sister pick out an outfit for a date. So. And, and guys, the debate was supposed to be between me and Onision. Lainey and I, I, I don't even see this as a debate. We're just talking. Like we're just, we're just kind of chilling. So don't, don't be upset and it, for any reason. You've been really sweet. I like the first one better. Okay, I have two more comments. <laughs> it's just, every time she's just sitting there going. Like twice now, Lainey has said, all right, well, I guess we're done here. And still, Joy is like getting those points where Lainey's just fucking ignoring the fact that she's even there. <laughs> all right, well, yeah, I gotta go, so. No worries. Well, I, it was... I don't nice know to if meet he you. wants to come and finish this off later, or I, I don't know what's going on with that, but... No, no worries, um, no worries. Well, I can yeah. say it was really nice to meet you. It's like, I don't know what the fuck he wants to do, but I want to go now. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you for being really sweet. Tell your husband, even though it went crazy, it was nice to meet him, too, and if he needs to finish this up or whatever, you know, he can, I guess, get at me. And, uh, yeah, if you ever need anything, Lainey, just, just reach out. Not that you would, but if you did, I'm, I'm around. All right. Sure, yeah. Oh, Lord, this motherfucker doesn't know how to read people. <laughs> All right, you have a good day. Bye. 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 All right, guys. I, yeah, I don't know if Greg's going to want to finish this later, but, um, yeah, I, I don't know what that even solved. But, yeah, thanks for watching and stuff. All right, bye. Okay, so one more time. Let's just, let's just check back at the beginning. What was it originally we did this for? Here we fucking go. You'll see who's really the fake person. Do you hate Joy? I don't like her, no. I 
tired of her talking about me and slandering me. Well, you're tired about me talking about you and slandering about you when I haven't talked about you in months. You don't want me to talk about you, yet you went on a live stream to defend your husband. We ended it peaceful. I thought everything was cool between us. All right. Sure, yeah. Oh, Lord, this motherfucker doesn't know how to read people. Yeah, Joy, you guys are best friends. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.